Hello everybody and welcome back to Analog Vernacular. Today we're going to be playing some more Fire Emblem Awakening. And uh, I think we're going to do some more optional missions to continue working on weapons masteries on some of the people that we just uh, uh, classed up. So Pan looks like she's getting close to getting her uh, D rank at, at the very least. Yep, both of them are actually getting close to their D rank, which is good. Um, that will open up a couple more options for them and their weapons. Um, so, let's see, we have two optional fights here, and both of them have these trickster units. I don't know what levels we're looking at here, but let's find out. Okay, mostly level 17s, and then I'm guessing you're going to be a, yep, high-level trickster. Okay. Yeah, I think that that's doable. We'll continue working on Olivia and Henry here. Maribel working towards her level 20 so that we can class her up. Lucina and Owain, we're also kind of working on that. Mostly Owain. Lucina's getting close. Um, should we switch out Rickon for somebody? I also need to decide... <sighs> Yeah, I got the skill on you that I wanted to get, so we don't need to focus too much on that if we don't want to. Looking at the units... Probably the only bows are going to be... Oh no, tricksters don't use bows. You have wind. So that's the one we have to worry about with any flyers we bring in. Fair enough. You're almost to level 20. I might actually want to... Let's see. Your experience is at 77, so yes, we absolutely do want to... Honestly, we don't need Celica's Gale. There's no flyers. So we're going to have you hold on to a Master Seal. Flocks, Ruin... Katarina's Bolt. kind of don't want to use Ruin here. We can't get another one of those right now, so let's instead give you... Let's see, Arc Fire's a Might 8. That's not bad. Let's give you an Arc Fire. So you have an 11, a 5, and an 8. here and let you attack all of these guys. Yeah, that's probably a good option. Thank <laughs> you. 
What a boss. What a boss. Not the greatest level up, but that's okay. Be ready. Nice. I mean, he is built to be a dodge tank. <laughs> Those two make a good pair. They are cousins, so they're not looking up. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Although I think the game actually lets you. Actually, I'm not even sure if that's true. <laughs> I could look, but... I won't be hooking them up, is what I'm saying. <laughs> Slow down. Love it. It's good stuff. That gets him working on his bow, too. I like that. So let's see, you're getting a plus one defense, you're getting a plus five speed. percent rude absolutely rude Arcwind one gone? I think so. Effective girl, you're gonna get yourself in trouble. She's gonna get killed just by war of attrition here. Fuck, 
What can that trickster do? Alright, that blocks the way. Hmm. the map doesn't it that was the last guy i was gonna i was gonna try and uh milk some more <laughs> support out of oh no there is that one guy. okay cool yeah we can milk some more support out of this um oh we can't reach that all right that's fine We're both getting real close. Even just being able to upgrade to iron is going to be a big deal. Both of them are hitting pretty damn hard right now. My lord. Nice. Okay. Pan and vake. Hey. Pan, you got a sec? Stop. Leave me be, human. She's so harsh with everybody. Nope. Sorry. Can't do it. We need to talk about your battle strategy. I don't like you running off and fighting the enemy on your own. Hmm. If you desire the glory of the kill, you will have to move faster. Huh? This ain't about glory. When you charge ahead like that, it puts us all in danger. We can't keep up, and then our formations start to break down. Stop. I'll not be told when and where to fight by ignorant man spawn. If my fighting style troubles you, you should look the other way. Hey! Shh, not likely. Even if I wanted to, you're always in the thick of the action. Stop. Man spawn usually find it easy to ignore the existence of a tagwell. <clears throat> Ugh, like you beasts are any better. You wish all us humans w uh, would up and vanish, and you don't mind saying so. Please. Why, you? Hey! Uh, don't try to deny it. We both know it's true. Hmm. Enough. If you wish me to follow like an obedient whelp, I shall oblige. It should prove amusing watching you blunder around the vanguard. <sighs> well, that could have gone better. I'd say. Damn. Lucina and Owain. So they do have an S rank. But they're cousins. We're not doing that. <laughs> hmm? Hey, Lucina. Huh? Greetings, Owain. How does the day find you? No. Good, good. Just thought I'd drop in for a visit. Very well. That's kind of you, but why are you speaking so strangely today? That is so strangely normal. You're typically much more, um, colorful? Making up stories and yelling and the like. Are you feeling all right? Well... Yeah, I I'm fine. It's just... You're a princess, Lucina. I figured it wasn't exactly appropriate for addressing royals. Plus, Mom would take my hide if she ever found out. What? Lissa would object to you spinning yarns for royalty? <laughs> Not just royalty, anybody. She gets really upset whenever I do it. Uh, actually, I suppose most everyone does. They think I'm a bit batty. What? Do they now? Th that's a shame. Personally, I find it quite intriguing. What? Really? Right. It's no simple feat to speak as you do when fantasy groups your mind. Inventing weapon names and such requires a rich vocabulary and quick thinking. And, of course, your stories demand a particularly active imagination. <laughs> Down, sword hand! Well, I guess they do, don't they? Thanks, Lucina. Of course! Perhaps you might even consider demonstrating how you do it sometime. I've often been told that my manner of speech is somewhat... formal. If I could learn to adopt your tone, it might prove useful to my own. What? You sound like you're asking me to teach you a foreign language. Uh, I'm not sure if this would be such a good idea. Huh? And if I were to pledge never to speak of it to Lyssa? <laughs> sword hand switches. So be it. Prepare yourself, young Lucina. Your destiny cometh. <laughs> ah, I can't wait. Very well. I look forward to it as well. That's great. Okay. Two of those down. We get another optional fight here. Let's do it. Okay, 
So we got a few more advanced classes in here. We've got several tricksters and some assassins and stuff. So this is going to be the hardest of all the optional fights we've done so far, for sure. Yeah, okay. A level 6 trickster. Okay. Um, we really do have to watch out for a couple of these guys. I think Cordelia gets her special skill at level 15. So she's a little far off, but... Let's see, do we want Virian? Or do we want Cordelia? No bows. Cordelia could be very good as a dodge tank. You still didn't hit your level 20, but I do kind of want Celica's Gale back. job of picking them based on how I like to pick them. Seriously shitty job. <laughs> okay, don't need a worm slayer. I probably should take a bow. Oh damn, I need another bronze. Sure, go ahead and break that thing. <laughs> Why not? You've got a short spear, that's good. So you might actually be good going after this one. But I need somebody really good here. you might be able to use that sometime in this fight, so... I'm 
I'm a little worried about this fight. Getting that kill, and you got it anyway, man. I don't want her to crit this. experience from that one. There's that weapon level.
Our two weapon level D's. of Katarina's bolt, so I'm just gonna use a flux here. Give the kill to a Wayne. That guy was doing a 22 times 2 against a Wayne there. That's wild. We got through that pretty quickly, honestly, and we don't have any more optional fights. So, we don't really have time for another mission, either. So that puts us in a weird spot where maybe I just need to end this episode a little bit early. We're about, like, 10 minutes early to our regular, like, 40 to 50 minute episodes. So, yeah, I think that's what we're gonna have to do. So, thank you all for being here. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And in the next one, we will either be doing a paralogue or going on to the next mission. I'm not sure which. Uh, so, yeah, have a good one, everybody.